Matthew Bainton plays a British method player who starred as Pete in the documentary. This is also playing Thomas Thorne for the first time in a UK series, playing a poet who cannot get a star. Thomas about 50 years after Isaac and Nigel in the mid-1820s. It is also known for its acting and producing in the series of Terrible Dates and several other United Kingdoms. Bainton spoke about what it is like to film the US series as a UK writer and actor, the thoughts on adapting the concept of ghost to the United States, and why American Ghosts fans need to sample British ghosts. Den of Geek, when did your role in Stupid S? How was it to meet US players? Matthew Bainton, I have a very bad memory, but it was a time during the summer holidays because I took my kids to Montreal with me and was great. It was a privilege that, England's ghosts, were the first to have the chance to play with our American cousins. I must absorb all the love from those men to create the original. Everyone was very nice. The vibe we have on the set in the UK is the real supportive, sincere, family atmosphere. We really want to make sure that everyone in the players and the crew feel a part of the team and want to come to work every day and have fun. And I felt exactly the same atmosphere in the CBS version, so I felt myself in my house. Where did the idea of the role of disgusting actor come from? They wrote this story about an actor who came to play Pete in the reconstruction of his, and I was first sent. The main point was that there was a story about Pete Pete and his awareness that he will be depicted as a fool who ignores his health and safety measures and is a fool. Pete does not want to see this thing that is disrespectful to the memory of his living relatives. The first version of the character was more like an old-school pit stage player. We talked about it and felt that it would be fun to play with the irony to reach the absolute truth of the character who claims to be more modern acting cliché and a method of method. The irony of using the word truth over and over again describes one million miles away from the reality of how they are. It was the most fun to be with Richie, just playing the game of being as disrespectful as possible to the character in front of him.